If there's meowing in the background, that's Mimi trying to get my attention. So today I'm going to be doing the basics tag. This was started by Hannah Yep. I'll leave her link in the southern bush. She is awesome, one of my favorites. I thought this looked like fun, so question one, tell us about your favorite jeans. So these are from American Eagle. They are the original boat jeans. They're really comfortable. I feel like the way they look on me. And yes, I do like wearing jeans a lot. So there's that. Question two, what is your most worn lip color? It changes, but for the past month, it has definitely been this Maybelline Color Whisper in Pink Possibilities. I am wearing that today. I mentioned this in my April favorites. It is just the perfect pink color and you can build it up. I'll show it to you quickly. Look at how wonderful that is. Question three, who are the YouTubers whose videos you learn the most from? I think I learn things from everyone, but the one that comes to mind first from the beauty community is Emily Noel 83 I just feel that she's always very informative. She gives a lot of great tips. And in the non-beauty world, the Vlog Brothers. Learn a lot of interesting things from them. And yes, I'm definitely a nerd fighter. Question four, how do you store your makeup? I thought it would be best if I took you over here and showed you. So my most used makeup is pretty much up here in this box that I got at Winners. And I keep my lip products here. This is where my eyeliners are. Foundations, concealers, highlights are here. A few other lip products. And my lesser used products, they're in this drawer right here. Question five, how often and how do you wash your makeup brushes? I deep clean my brushes once a week. And for that, I use baby shampoo. It doesn't cost much and it works very well for me. I never felt the need to have a high-end, expensive brush cleanser. Question six, what is your favorite red, nude, and baby pink nail color? My favorite red would have to be the CoverGirl Outlast Day Brilliant in Forever Festive. It's a gorgeous red with tiny bits of glitter in it. Nude, this is actually the only nude nail polish I actually like. Most of them I just find them boring and whatever. I found this recently and I have been enjoying it. It's Butter London's Yummy Mummy, and yes, I am wearing this now. It's a nice beige color, and it has tiny bits of silver glitter. Neutral, but it's not boring. And these Butter London nail polishes are awesome. The formulation is great. They don't have any gross chemicals. For Baby Pink, I like Essie's We're In It Together. This color was limited edition, but I think they might have one similar in the permanent line. It's light pink with tiny bits of lilac colored glitter. Super pretty. And y'all know Essie is my favorite brand of nail polish. So there's that. Question seven, do you make any beauty treatments at home? I actually recently discovered this awesome recipe for homemade sugar scrub. I have it here. Basically it's brown sugar, a bit of white sugar, olive oil, honey, and vanilla. So it's all natural and it is the best scrub ever. It makes my skin super soft. It's very easy to make as well. I could do a video on making it if you want to see that. All it might be a while before that's uploaded because this is gonna last me quite a while. Question eight, what is your most made meal at home? If you watch my vlog channel, you'll probably already know the answer to this. It is my homemade macaroni and cheese. Trust me, it is better than anything Kraft Dinner can come up with. I found the recipe online, so I randomly decided to try it out, and I've been loving it ever since. Question nine, best multi-purpose products? I would have to say MAC Fix Plus. I usually use this just to give my skin a bit of hydration. It feels wonderful and smells amazing. I've also been using it as a setting spray recently. It's been super hot here, and my AC's not on yet does actually work very well for that purpose. My makeup has been lasting longer in spite of the crazy heat. Finally, question 10. Tell us about the bag you carry most often. This has gotten worn down a bit because I am in love with it. It is from Walmart. It's not huge or anything, but I'm not one of those people who carries an entire beauty salon in their purse. So it's good for me. And I think it's so cute and pretty. All right. So, as usual, I'm not going to tag anyone, but if you do it, make sure you leave it as a video response down below. That's all I've got for you now. 
I love you, and you'll see me soon. Bye!